Hi everyone and welcome back. Now today I am looking at Cadbury Mini Rolls um, and they are a festive chocolate orange flavour. Now I'm not sure if these have been done before um, but I know they're out for the festive period so I thought I'd just buy them and give them a try and give them a review. So here we are. So they are a pack of eight. I paid £1.50 for them. Now I've got them in Asda and now um, Let's have a look. Um, do, 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 do. It's just your bit. Of, I suppose it's just your orange flavour. Dumb chocolate mini rolls. I'm looking on the packaging. Let's see what it says. Do, 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 do. Individu individually wrapped uh, chocolate orange mini rolls. That's it. Um, so let's get the packet open. Let's open them up. Eight in a box. Let me get one open. Little normal size mini rolls. Ah, oh, put that down. So there you go. Straight away, taste the chocolate orange. Just taste it, smell it. Um, that's better. So straight away, yep, yeah, you can smell the chocolate orange. Let's give it a go. Mm. They are quite nice. Um, the chocolate, the chocolate's nice. As I, I mean, I like these mini rolls anyway. The orange flavour isn't overpowering. Just a nice, it's just a nice delicate flavouring. Um, I could actually eat quite a few of them, but I won't because I'm not a pig. Um, so yeah, the sponge is nice and soft, the chocolate is nice, the chocolate orange is delicate, not overpowering, not too strong. Mm. It would go really well with a nice nice cup of tea or coffee or whatever. Hmm. Very nice. Now, one thing I'm gonna mention. So I'm I'm gonna wrap this one up pretty quickly. Um I get a lot of people um asking me and mentioning why is everything orange flavour around Christmas? I'll explain that. Um but going back to the going back to the mini rolls, very nice, very soft, delicate flavour. Would I have them again? Yes, I would. Would I buy them? Yes. And did I like them? I did indeed. So to wrap it up, they're a great mini roll. Go try them. I got them from Asda, but again, um, probably available in all large supermarkets, um, co-ops, and sparrows and everything else. So that's it. Now moving on to why is everything orange at Christmas? I've got four explanations for you, okay? Now, before I, before I begin, um, if you don't know what a dowry is, it's an amount of property or money bought by a bride to her husband on their marriage. I mean, I'm, go, I'm going back, I'm going back a long, long, long time. So, what explanation one? Now, this could be lengthy, so if you want to switch off now, that's great, take care and I'll see you on my next food review. If you don't, I'll explain why everything is orange. So, St Nick, St Nicholas and his sacks of gold. Okay, now this one goes back hundreds of years um, to St Nicholas, who is born in the country, what we now call Turkey. Um, he inherited a, a large sum of money, um, but he devoted his time and his life to helping people um, that were less fortunate than himself. And according to the story, St Nicholas learned of a poor man who wasn't able to find suitors for his three daughters. Um, so 
and that was because they didn't have money for a dowry. Um, so St Nick travelled to the house um, and f tossed three pieces of gold down the chimney for each of the dowries because um, he had three doors. So, and, and the gold just happened to land in each of the girls' stockings that was hanging on the fireplace um, to dry out. So, yeah, that, that, that's one. And the oranges we receive today are a symbol of the gold that was left in the stockings by St Nick. So orange, gold, that's one explanation. That's the lengthy one. Now two, a treat during the Great Depression. During the Great Depression of the 1930s, money was tight and many families simply didn't have the means to buy any gifts for anybody. Um, instead, um, it was such, it, I mean, it was such a treat back then, even a luxury to find things like a sweet orange or um, anything. Um, walnuts maybe, anything like that in your stocking at Christmas. So that's, that's the second thing. The third explanation, um, oranges were once a very scarce treat. Um, some also offer the idea that fresh oranges were hard to come by, especially up in the north. Um, so finding one of these fruits in your stocking was a massive treat, a huge treat, and a way of celebrating the holidays. And number four, I like this one, um, it's the season of giving, right? Another theory behind the tradition is that December is the, is the, is the season for giving, um, and the orange segments represent the ability to share what you have with others. Are we liking that? Good. Well, that's my four um, explanations for everything's orange at Christmas. So, guys, thanks for watching. Have a lovely day, whatever you're doing, wherever you are, whoever you are. Keep your chin up, keep smiling, and I will see you all again very soon. Take care.